problem with vape is that the chemical content within the pot is truly unknown. The main component that everybody is worried about is especially nicotine. That taken from a young age can actually cause brain growth stunting. Nicotine is even more addictive than some of the known drugs around the world. The flavours in the vape pots is meant to pique your curiosity. And once you take that first puff, the nicotine gets you addicted. There's always this myth that vaping is safer than cigarettes. But the nicotine content within the vape can be as high as 50 cigarettes. Some people actually smoke the entire pot, 50 sticks of cigarettes in one whole day. Some people think vaping is harmless if you're not addicted. The thing about vapes is that it needs a metal coil to heat the liquid substance itself to become vapor. So the metal itself, heated repeatedly, can degrade and it releases all sorts of metals and metalloids. So all these things are dangerous to the body. Risks of cancers are there. Some of the chemicals can actually cause seizures, blackouts and because they cause respiratory failure, they may actually lead to death. Some vapes are laced with drugs like etomidate. Etomidate is an anaesthetic agent. So the etomidate, if inhaled, people can go into this zombie-like state. They can get muscle spasms, seizures. Some people vape to cope with stress, but there are so many other healthier ways to cope with stress. You can go for a walk, you can exercise, go for a bike ride, spend time with family members and friends. Quitting vape is possible. You can always approach any healthcare professionals and they will be able to guide you accordingly. Get help to quit with the Quit Vape program at gov.sg slash quitvape.